This problem says that the perimeter of the triangle is 85 feet. Find the lengths of its sides. Okay, so remember for any triangle, let's just draw an arbitrary triangle here with sides A, B, and C. The perimeter is just the sum of those three sides, A plus B plus C. Okay, so here we have our perimeter is 85 feet. So 85 equals, well, let's do a x squared plus 3, calling this a plus b, a, b, uh, let's do b up here, just to be consistent with the other picture that I drew, plus c. Okay, so plus b was 2x, call that b, plus c, 2x plus 5. Okay, wonderful. Uh, combine like terms. So we have 85 equals x squared. Let's see, we have these two x's that go together, and then 3 and 5 go together. So x squared plus 4x plus 8. Now let's get one side equal to 0. Anytime you have x squared on one side, you want to have 0 on the other side. Cool, so let's subtract 85 from both sides and we get 0 equals x squared plus 4x minus 77. Okay, well, let's see here. So we want to factor that creature. We have negative 77 and 4. We want factors of negative 77 that add to 4. Factors of negative 77 that add to 4. Well, I'm looking right in the middle here, because this is a small number, so we'll look kind of in the middle. Look, 77 is 11 times 7, um, not accounting for the negatives, and 11 minus 7 is 4, so we're in good shape here. Let's just work on the negatives here. This is a positive 4, so I'll choose the bigger of these two to be positive. So we have 11 times negative 7. So note that when we multiply these, we get negative 77, but when we add them, we get 4. Okay, so we're in luck. Plus 11, minus 7, so this factors as 0 equals x plus 11, x minus 7. Okay, well now we can use that 0 factor property, x plus 11 equals 0, x minus 7 equals 0. Subtract 11 from both sides x equals minus 11, add 7 to both sides, x equals 7. Now these are lengths here, so we can't have a negative length at this point. So what we have here is x equals 7. But that is not our answer yet. So don't stop there. Let's go back up to the top and see what we actually needed. Find the lengths of its sides. x is not the length of the side. We have x equals 7. That's true, but that's not the length of the side. So let's switch over to green here. So this, this side, we would have 7 squared plus 3. 49 plus 3 is 52, and our units feet. 52 feet for that side down there. Here we would do 2 times 7 plus 5. 14 plus 5 is 19 feet. There we go. And then over here we do 2 times 7, which is 14 feet. There's our third side. So 14, 52, and 19 feet. 